Bye. There are people doing this on the uh, dock for five hours. Later. They're still, I can still see them. Uh, <laughs> Ship's very big. That's a John Mulaney joke. I can't claim ownership of that. That's, That's from John Mulaney. What's up, everybody? My name is Nick. I'm Mike. We are the Brothers Murphy. Then we are playing Great Western Trail, Argentina. Boom, all right. Super excited to play this This is one. kind of the second part of the trilogy of Great Western Trail yeah. games and stuff. This one's set in Argentina. We are heading to Buenos Aires instead of to Kansas City, like in the original Great yep. Western Trail. There's also some other things that are changed up from the original while leaving the sort of mechanical soul and yeah. heart and meat of Great Western Trail still intact. Yeah, but the things that are different are really make it feel we different. We think so, yeah. But nonetheless, we're gonna go into a whole overview of Great Western Trail Argentina. Before we do, give this video a thumbs up. And and yeah, hopefully you're excited for this one. I'm really excited for this one. I'm really excited for the next one, too. Absolutely, so enjoy this overview. In Great Western Trail Argentina, players will be running cattle through the board and up to Buenos Aires where they'll be shipped off to Europe. On their turn, the player will move their Estancianiero to the different buildings on the board. The building they stop on will activate and will do a number of different things. Many buildings allow you to discard a certain type of cattle to gain pesos. Some spots will allow you to hire employees which will go onto your player board here. You may hire gauchos which help buy cattles, carpinteros which help you build buildings, and maquinistas which help you move your train. There is also a spot for granjeros, but we'll talk about them in a bit. Buildings with a cow on them are where you buy cattle. Which cattle you can buy and how much they cost depends on how many gauchos you have. For instance, if you have one gaucho, you can purchase a level 3 cow for 5 pesos. If you have two, you can buy one for 2 pesos, and if you have three, you can buy two level 3 cows for 5 pesos. This action here allows you to construct your own buildings using your carpinteros. Each of your buildings requires you to have a certain amount of carpinteros shown here. When you pay for a building, you will put it on any open spot on the board. Your buildings will do a whole bunch of different things, but most are stronger variations on the actions on the generic buildings. This action allows you to move your train using your maquinistas. You will move your train equal to how many maquinistas you have. If you come across a train station, you may stop your train there and pay to place a disc at this station. And if a station master tile is there, you may place one of your employees here to gain that bonus tile. These tiles will give you a one-time boon or an ongoing bonus and will provide endgame scoring. This action allows you to help out one or more granjeros. On the board are granjeros and you will be able to gain them when you use this action. To gain a granjero, you will need to pay their strength level shown in these scythes. Some employees will have a scythe on them which provide one strength, and these two spots will give strength if uncovered. But mostly your strength will come from your cattle. Each cow has strength on them shown here, and you can discard a cattle from your car to use the strength to gain a granjero. Though doing so will gain you an exhaustion card which gunks up your hand. Hey, you're having your cow go do work in their field, it's hard work and they're getting tired. When you gain a granjero, you can leave them to the side where they'll be worth two points at the end of the game and they can be used toward objectives, or you can flip them over and place them in their row after paying the peso cost and keep them on as an employee. And then this spot here will give you grain equal to how many granjeros you have as employees. We'll talk about what grain does in a bit. This spot allows you to gain an objective card which will gain you points at the end of the game if you meet its requirements. This spot allows you to use an auxiliary action on your board here if they are uncovered. Okay, that's all the main actions, but what happens when our instancenieros get to Buenos Aires? When you get to the end of the trail, you have arrived at Buenos Aires, though you may have noticed these spots here. If your train has reached one of these spots, you now have a shortcut to get to Buenos Aires. Once you get to a shortcut you've reached, you may immediately go to the end. Whenever you get to Buenos Aires, the first thing you can do is move one of your discs from the ports into the city if you have any. This will cost grain and can gain you pesos and end game points. As I stated, your cattle are being shipped off to Europe, which means they need to be put onto a ship. When you get to Buenos Aires, you will count up all the breeding value on your cattle in your hand shown here. The catch is you can only count unique cattle, so if you have two Patagonicos, you can only count one. You will then gain money equal to your breeding value and then you will place one of your discs onto a boat. The boats have a value and you may place a disc on any boat equal to or less than your breeding value. So if we had a hand equaling 9, we can place our cattle in any of these boats. Though to place a disc on a boat, you usually have a grain cost. Your cows gotta eat on the journey across the pond. You will then place 1A, 1B, and 1C tile out on the board. These will be granjeros or more employees to hire. So what happens once your cattle are on a ship? You may have noticed that the ships are either yellow, teal, or purple. When this marker here passes the color of ship, in this case yellow, all of the yellow ships will sail off to Europe. The ships will either sail to Liverpool, Le Havre, great game, or Rotterdam. 
and any discs on those ships will be placed on these port spaces on the city board, which can then be moved into the city on a later turn. After you've done all this, your Instancinieto will be placed back at the beginning and play will continue. The game will end once this token is pushed off the employee board and then players will score. Players will gain 1 point for every 5 coins, 4 points on their buildings, from any discs on stations, and any endgame scoring from station master tiles they have. Points from discs in cities and on ships, and points from cattles and objectives. Players gain 2 points for every granjero they have. Note that this does not include the ones who are employees. They will gain points if they hire enough employees to reach these spaces and if they uncovered this space here. And finally, the player who ended the game gains two points, and the player with the most points will win. All right, man, let's start this here trail to the west of Argentina. Indeed. All right. So the first move on, you can just basically drop into any of the buildings and just take so that I action. I always forget that rule. And then you move. You can start in that first action. I'm just trying to think Where's of... Your... Instantiero. It's right here. Oh, it's right. Because I haven't you put it in there like... yet. Um, I'm going to start actually right uh, no. over here. Boom. I'm going to start here. My first action, Nick. I'm going to discard any two identical cards. My two Niatas yeah. are the same. I'll get two pesos for that. And then I can move my train for every Machinista I have. This is the first turn. I've only got the one. We've got I'll one at least. Yeah. down the line. Machinista. There we go. I'm going to draw back um, up. Man, yeah, that's a toughie. Tuffy makes scruffy. Yeah, where do you begin? What do you focus on? What's the yeah. vibe? I I also have an influx of uh, Niatas. So actually, because I start, so I'm second, I start with five cards in my hand. I have to discard down to four. I have three Niatas, I'm not going to lie. So I'm going to get rid of one, one of them sure. at least. Um, and man, I'm uh, I'm trying to decide if I should start in the same spot as you. Sure. I don't know. We did just for the purposes of explanation on the setup, these neutral buildings, we randomized. You can match A with A, and they suggest that for your first games and yeah. stuff, but I was like, Nick's, Nick can handle it. And keep in mind, this one also, the path, if you've never seen this game, the path is usually in, in Grand Central, it's over here. So I guess it goes, it goes up this here. way, and then this way, and then this way like that. So just yeah. know that that's the way we're I'm moving I'm not going to lie. Train also goes backward. It's wild. There's a lot, there's some adjustments there's to make. There's going on. There's a lot of adjustments to make. Um, I'm going to go, let's start here. Let's start by Instantietto right there. And Instantietto just means rancher, which is awesome. You're, you're a rancher there. Uh, indeed. I'm going to get rid of my uh, Patagonico right here, which is uh, two green to get two more bucks. And then I can build a building with my uh, Carpintero right here, which I have one. I think we build this first building because okay. getting grain in this game is V useful. Whereabouts do you want it to go? I imagine on a farmland yes. you can help... You know. So this is kind of like the forest tiles in the other ones, but in this case you want to go on farmlands. Um, yeah, so I think it's probably going to put it right here. We'll sure. just start off with some grain. It's also got that hand. It's a private building. Like, sir, trespass. Sir, you got to pay me a peso. Is, you got to pay me a peso coming through here. Sir. Uh, okay, that's okay. me. I'm going to move. Um, I, I'm tempted to go here just to get the certification, but I'm yeah, actually going to go sweet. one, two over to here. Turn in one of my Orlando Argentinos for two pesos. Okay. And uh, I can buy? do some, some hirings, man. I can do some hirings. Um, I'm going to hire this Machinista. They cost seven pesos, but since they have a strength icon, it's always one more. Yeah. So I'm going to pay eight for that. That's not going to leave me with enough money to, to hire a second employee, Yeah, unfortunately. Uh, so I'm going to go here. This allows me to trash a card from Ooh. my hand. And I'm going to trash a Niata. Let's get Bye. out of here. Let's go. I do have an exhaustion card in my hand, not going to lie. But I'm just going to hang on to it. Maybe I can really? get rid of it another way. Because I'm yeah. thinking long term. Oh, wow. Okay. Long okay. term here, sir. All right. I'm going to go uh, where Mikey was. I will turn my two uh, Niatas right here uh, to get, what is it, two bucks? Mm -hmm. um, and then my Machinista will allow my train to move one. I still only have one Machinista here, so, so I'll you will one. leapfrog Boop. me. Almost close, almost that first shortcut. I uh, no, yeah. The shortcuts are the nice. It's so cool. I'm just going to go one step forward, Nick. I'm going to collect an objective. We're early game, so I feel pretty good about all my chances. You should be able to get any I'm going to collect that one that's the furthest to the right. This one? Yes. So you need a four cow and something in the west yeah. on one of these spots. All right, so I can get that done by the end of the game. Certainly, I can do one single auxiliary action. Uh, I will do the draw a card, discard a card action. And then I can move my train one spot forward, which does get me to the first little shortcut if I want. That's going to be nice because this is going to start to fill up with Grand Harrow's It probably. will, yeah. It starts getting... So, 
The yeah, shortcuts get pay. useful. <laughs> yeah, there's a lot of farmland being sold out there, and all these ground arrows are like, you gotta come across my farmland. You gotta pay me. Yeah, I'm like, yeah, that's fair. I'm rich. You know, we got people. I gotta get. I got a big old lot. You're trying to bring a bunch of cows through my farmland, trampling all my stuff. You at least gotta pay me. It's like, yeah, that's fair. Pay the grass fee. That's kind of fair. Um, I think I'll go. I think I'll just go here and I'll get a ribbon. And then do I want to buy a Grand Harrow? Can help out the Grand Harrows, man. I definitely can. Ooh, this one has seven strength. You got oh, no, that's what they cost seven the strength. The cheapest is three strength to two. Yeah. There's two of them that are three, and so you can help them out and recruit them that way. Yeah, I am if going to. If you're spending to... cards from your hand, you'll have to take some exhaustion. Yeah. But it's early. There's plenty of time to get rid of things. I think I am. I think I'm going to spend. So it's going to cost me. Um, uh, I'm gonna get this one right here, right. and I have a couple duplicates. So I'm gonna turn in this Patagonico and this Orlando Argentina, uh, Argentino rather, and they have four strength between them. This only takes three strength, so I will take this one. I think I'm gonna turn them into a Grand Helm. I'll hire them as an employee. So again, we take them off, you can either have them just off the side, they'll be worth points, or they can be good for things like objectives, or you can flip them over to their kind of uh, normal side pay to put them here, and then um, they become employees yours. I think yeah. I'm gonna do that, because I have some money right now. And they'll gain an instant grain, so that's good. They'll gain an instant grain for covering up uh, that spot right there. Nice. Boom, and then again, if there's any um, pesos underneath here, you would also get those, but you, I, there's nothing. Or above, as you pass by, if you have to pay them fees, you actually leave the money on the board, yeah. which goes toward that as well. Yeah, and I had two duplicates in my hand, so I was like, you know what, let's get rid of those. I will have I to like take it. an exhaustion, though, unfortunately. Yeah, there's plenty of time to get rid of it. Might not My even cows are tired, man. Might just lose it when you shuffle the cards. You know what I mean? Just lose right. that. Just lose it. I'm going to go here. I have one Grand Hero to start, so I'll get one grain. And then here, I can trash an exhaustion card from my hand. So I'll just trash that right there. Nice. Yeah, Thank here. you very much. Bye. Okay, and that's going to be it for me. Okay. I'm going to come on whoop, down here. I will get rid of one of my uh, Orlando Argentinos for two bucks, and then I can hire someone. I think I might get this gaucho up here that is six. Ooh, or do I want to do what Mikey did and get a gaucho that gives me a strength? So that costs you eight. I, I have eight. Yeah. And we're about to go to Argentina. You know what, let's do it. Let's okay. go boom, blow it all. Let's get yeah, this, this gaucho here, because sure. this gaucho has a scythe on it, which again costs one more. Ooh, I'll get a uh, exchange token as well. Very nice. Sweet. Okay. okay. Uh, I am going to go to Buenos Aires. So here I am. Buenos Aires. First thing you can do is you can do one extra delivery. If you have discs, we start with one Lahav over there. Um, I will spend one grain, because that's the one grain I got, and I'll move a disc from here down here and simply collect four pesos. Nice. Not worth points, but it gets me some money, gets me some stuff right now. We like that. Cash is we good. We like that. Uh, all right, now I'm going to turn in a, a hand of Seven, these are all different uh, named cows, so they are all able to score. I've got two, four, six, and seven, so I'll get seven nice. pesos. Those that get discarded. Uh, and I can go on to a ship that's up to seven, so I think I'm gonna go for seven. I think I'm gonna go for we it. You got two grain? I don't, but I can, can pay, pay money, two yeah. bucks a piece, so it's a little bit steep. I guess in that regard, that's interesting. You wanna go lower and not I have to I kinda do might that? wanna go here and save two bucks. <sighs> but the thing is, like early game, you get a seven hand. I think I shouldn't squander that. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna go for the seven, and I'm just gonna, you know, have to pay some extra cash. So I can take a disc off. Yep. Um, I'll fly at this. I think I'll get some more ability to get money, and maybe recoup that. I'll yep. go here. The grain cost is two. I can either pay in grain or two dollars per grain. I can't pay. Um, I'm just buy it there, right there on the uh, harbor. So, so what's the bucks. one when you're paying grain? You can't you can't pay money here. Can't pay okay, money there. Got to grain it up. Think about the way I think about it is like that grain's on the ship. Yeah. Feeding the cattle, right? Mm -hmm. So you can't you can't pay you can't just phone up France. Fair. That'd be crazy. Hey. Um, but so I'll go there, and this allows me to collect an objective. Mm. Um, let's go with. Let's go with um, that second one right this there one with right the here? two threes. Yep, in a northern. Areas. So these little compasses refer to what areas you are in yeah, the city. Yeah, what quadrant in the city? Quadrant. There you go. A little quarter. Indeed. Um, all right. So that's all of that. Now I'm gonna put some stuff on the board. I will add a green Grand Hero. Um, does this I'll go here? Add, sorry. Yes, it does. Thank you. Missed it. Um, I will add Carpentero or Carpentero. Carpen, Carpentero. And then yeah, might as well make it a little more expensive for you. Yeah. Boom. All right. Boom. 
And I'm back around the horn Boom. if you can put me at the start of the trail. Thank you, sir. Okay, um, do I want to go there? What do I think I'll be able to do? Yeah, let's go here. We're gonna go here. We're gonna get an objective. Which one do I wanna get? All these have Grand Harrows, and then three of them have buildings. I think I'm gonna build at least one more building, so I'm gonna get Got, this one. Right? Yeah, I think right. I'll build at least one, one more. One way there. And I, I can get a green uh, Grand Hero at some point. Um, I dig it. There's already two out there, so I can probably grab one at some point. Um, and then I'll use one auxiliary action. Um, I will, ooh. I think I'm just gonna get a peso. Um, and then my Machinisa will move my train forward one. So I can go to the shortcut. Um, wonderful. I'm gonna go, I think just to this first spot right there. Boop. I can move my train twice. That's right, you have two. Um, I can stop off here. I'd have to get rid of my new Makanisa. I don't think I'm gonna do that. So I think I'm just gonna go one, two down the line. Okay. And just get, get boogie in. Well, you don't have to necessarily get rid of your Makanisa. If you put a disc down there. I know, but I have to stop, don't I? You do have to stop, yes. So it's like, do you wanna get up that next shortcut kind of thingy? Oh, or do you wanna go down there and stop? That's a good question. The shortcuts make it much more difficult to choose because you're like, ooh. I know. I want to be able to go early. I think I want to. I think I want to be able to go earlier. Okay. I, it's two points. Maybe I'll maybe I'll lose by two and I'll live to hey, regret it. Hey, uh, it. I can do an auxiliary action. I'll just get two dollars. Cool. Two pesos, please. Uh, go. I'm gonna move here. I'm gonna get grain for my granjeros, and I have two now, so I'm gonna oh, go up to three nice. grain. Um, and then I, oh, I can get rid of an exhaustion card, which I do have one in my hand. So let's go ahead and get rid of an exhaustion I'm card. Trash that. I was I was waiting for this one, I was gonna get rid of it here. Yeah. And then I was like, oh, I forgot that that's why you can get rid of an exhaustion card. Yeah, it's nice. You can always right. do that and you'll be able to draw a card. Hopefully that's one that's more useful. Nope. Um, there you go, you never know. It wasn't. Um, okay, I'm going to go to this spot. So I'm gonna go one, two. I have to pay a peso on the way to you, sir. Thank you. Uh, I will turn in a fronterizo cow for two pesos. Fronterizo. Very cute cow. Uh, adorable. Just like teensy little horns like hey, friend. Uh, okay, I've got one gaucho, so I'm gonna buy some cattle. Chris so, Williams can draw a cow. Chris Williams knows their way knows around a cow. Knows their way around a cow. Um, real quick, can you splay those out, the, the three? Yeah, years? so I'll put this right here. So we have uh, two Blanco Ojinegros, which have three points. A Serrano has two, and this Chiqueño has one, and then five and strength, four, kind of three, inverse. three, yeah. Uh, I'm gonna spend five, and I'm gonna get, uh, I'm gonna get the blue, please. Okay. Actually, no, I'm, I'm gonna get Serrano. Oh, sorry. Because there's there's two blue. I can get that later. All right. And that's it for me. Okay. Uh, I will go to um, Buenos Aires. I said Argentina. We're already in Argentina. The good thing is, is I actually don't have to go to this farmer because I can go, whoop, go up this. So you're up. basically going da -da 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 -da. Bye. Ah, ah, <laughs> like that exactly. Around. So I don't have to pay that uh, the pay so to go past that farmer, which correct, is nice. Correct. Okay, so now I can bring this disc down. I think I will. I think I'm going to spend one of my grain. Okay. And I'm going to come down here to this spot and get four pesos. You're going to save some grain, is it? Huh? So you're not going to spend more? No, because I want to kind of be able to go up higher. Later. Up on no, on here, and I don't really want to have to spend the money to do it. Because I have the grain, so I dig it. And I'll be able to get to these spots, I think, so Absolutely. I'm not too worried about it. I will turn in. I do have two uh, fronterizos, and so you will go away. But I do have six, and I have a ribbon, so I can pop up two seven. Okay. But you know what? The six and the seven cost the same amount of grain. The only thing is, is this one's going to ship out sooner. So do I want to make sure I go there? Let's go ahead and do that. That way I, I know... I'll have more time to get onto a teal ship, basically. So I will use this to get up to seven. It's gonna cost me two grain, which I do have. So I'll spend that two grain. That way I don't have to spend any of my money. Mm -hmm. um, so I will get seven pesos for my breeding value. And then I will take, let's get the ability to draw two cards and discard two cards. And I'll go boop right up here with Mikey. I will also get another Oof, I'll also get another objective. Now, which one do I want? Let's go with this one. Okay, you're up, Maggie. All righty. Come on, Stunts me at all. Woo! Shoot down oh, I'm, sorry, hold on. I'm sorry, brother. I need to do this part. Oh, I that snap, part. man. I did the rest of it, and then got to populate the board. Part. Let's put out, where's the blue? Let's put out a blue Granjero, because there's not one out here yet. Yep. Uh, let's put out another Carpintero. Get it right there. And then let's put out another Machinista. All right. 
Okay, there right. we go. Now I'm done. No, we're good. It's on this side of the board. I'm freaking out. I don't know. I what to know. Do. Where am I even? Um, Who am I? I'm going to turn in a Patagonico for two pesos, and then I'm going to build a building. Uh, I'm going to build this building right up here. So it allows me to do two auxiliary actions and then move one space mm, forward. Yeah, that's a good so one. So I'm going to do that. It's going to cost me two pesos, the two that I just gained. On to you. Hmm. I'm going to shuffle my cards. Yep. Whoa. Do I want to stop? Wow. God, what a bad hand. <laughs> um, let's go. Yeah, let's go right here. We're just going to stop. Oops, sir. Drunk. I'm gonna go right here. I'm gonna move one forward because I have one machinista, and then I'll get two. I'm gonna go. You ahead wanna and do... pull into the station? Yeah, screw it. All right. It's only gonna cost me one buck. Oh, do I want to get rid? So one thing you cannot put your ground harrows up there. I don't think I want to get rid of my gaucho, but I think I will just put a disc down there. Yeah, might as well. So I paid the buck. Put that disc right there. Bought two points for a dollar. Yeah, why not? Why not? Okay, and then I'll have this. I'm gonna go ahead and do this auxiliary action here, which I can draw two cards and then uh, discard two cards. So you can go ahead and. Yep, my lord. I like it. I'm, I'm going to move more one step forward. Gosh. I'm going to turn into uh, Fronterizos for two pesos. And um, then I can move my train for two steps. I'm going to go one. I will pull into this station. I will spend yeah. one. Perpetual ribbon is so hard to beat, you know? Yeah. I'm going to do that. And then I want to get more Machinistas because I really want to focus on my train. And they have strength, but I am going to replace them. Bye, friend. Become the master. Gives me one certificate, perpetual, and at the end of the game, for every two discs I have on the remaining ships, I get three points. Sweet. So, you know, hopefully we can make oh, something happen there. Um, let's go ahead and go here, and I'll get one grain per building I have on a farm. I only have one right now, but I'll get that grain. And then it's you. Okay, I'm going to play real quick my objective Oh, here. I'm sorry. I was also going to play my objective here. There you go. I'll get three pesos for this. I will get one grain. Okay, day. And then I'm going to, hmm, I want to help some Grand head Harrows, man. Kind of expensive right now. You got one that's on your phone. three. Four. Oh, there's three up here. That's not it. I will. I'll take a, I'll get a certification, and I'm going to do this. I'm going to turn in two cards. So I'll have to take one exhaustion. That gives me two strength, and one is three total. Um, and I'm going to hire them on, so I'll pay the money. Pay six pesos, one, two, three, four, five, and six to make them an employee. Flip them face down, that gives me a grain. All right, hmm, right on. I'll go right here, I'll turn in this fronterizo to get two, oh, do I even want to? Don't have to. No, you know, I think I have enough money. I'm just gonna keep that in my hand to not get two pesos, but I can buy cows. I do have two gauchos. So, I mean, gosh, I could buy one of these big old fivers. It would take a lot of my money. Yeah, it would take basically all my money. But with two, the other thing I can do is I can get a three for just two bucks, which is pretty darn good. Mm-hmm. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. We're going to get a, for two bucks, my two gauchos. Oh, I could also get this one and just get, like, Dumb strong cow. Yeah, they're not, how angry this cow is. They're you not know? most the highest breeding value, although you know it's different than the gray, so it could help you in that regard. It's three points, and they are they are a beast of burden. Yeah, time. I'm gonna get one of these. I'm gonna get a blanco orejinegro, which we learned is white with black ears, which is what they are. It's exactly what they have. It's very cute. They're adorable. I will get one of those for two bucks. <sighs> they're my favorite. They're my favorite. They're sweet souls. You can tell. <laughs> Beautiful souls. Me? Yeah. All right, man. I'm going here. Bam. I don't have a cow to turn in, unfortunately. I'll also play subjective and just move my train up to the eight. Um, but I'm going to hire somebody. I've got six pesos. I'm just going to hire this gaucho for six. That will get me an exchange token, and it is on to you, my friend. Okay. Um, I'm going to go... I don't think I need to go past this Granjero, so I'm going to go up here. I don't have anything to turn in, but I do want to build another building. I still only have one Carpintero. So I can still only build one of these things. Let's go ahead and do, let's do go, let's do go here, Nick. Good call, good call, good call, good call. Them's let's works. do go there. Them's, them's um, works. And what this do goes, nice little combo. do does does good, is yeah, so I'll basically two auxiliary actions and I can move over to here and get this one. And this is also in a farm, so I'll get two grain when I do that. That's well done. It's kind of silly to put two of the two auxiliary actions right next to each other. 
But I'm like, ah, if I don't even move my Macanista, yeah, I'd say then you can. I'm just, just like, yeah, I'll just go to this one instead and do that. I you think know, it's plenty viable. Yeah, yeah. Because I can move my train up here, so I'm kind of like, ah, eh, let's do that. And that costs uh, two bucks to do that. Wonderful. Okay. Okay, I'm going to go one, two down here. Speaking of, I'm going to draw two cards and discard two cards. Hopefully get my hand right. Get my hand right. Right. My and body then, ready. Then I'm going to come here, and uh, I can do, I can gain uh, grain for my Grand Heroes. i got two of them. And I can do a single auxiliary action. I'm just going to take a peso. Hmm. A bad move. I mean, I guess I could do... What's the, yeah, I guess I'll do a card, actually, because if I not, I can just discard this. Be there. <laughs> Should have kept the peso. <laughs> Should have kept the dang peso. I'm going to get rid of my two niatas right here. I'm going to get uh, two pesos for that. Um, and then I will move my train up one. And that's weird. Okay, I'm going to go uh, JK up here to Buenos Aires via the shortcut. I don't have any discs that can be moved into the city, yeah. so I'll skip that part. I well, do we're pretty have, close to shipping out here. Yeah, we're we're we Oof. not gonna be shipping this turn, but when you get to Buenos Aires, we certainly will. Um, I've got uh, blah, blah, one, three, six, and eight. I have a perpetual certificate, so I have nine. I could turn one in for ten, Ooh. which I don't think it'll work, but I can get to the nine, That's so cool. I will do that. So uh, eight from my cards, one from this. No, uh, nothing else needed there. I've got nine. So I can take one of the black bordered discs off. I think I'm gonna increase my hand limit. Yeah, it's always it's hard to beat that. Always one. seems nice. This costs four Ooh, grain. These don't cost money anymore. Say again. These don't cost money anymore. No. Oh, that's great. This costs four <laughs> grain. I'm gonna spend one, two, three grain, and then two dollars from the nine that I earned. Okay. Um, yeah. Leaving Sweet. me with seven left over. And then let's see. I'm gonna add. I want to do some stuff. I'm gonna add this. Green Grand Hero there. Uh, I'm gonna add a Machinista here. And then these are the same, so this will go here. Okay. That is it for me. I'm back down to the start of the train. Estanciero, going back down to the ranch. Back on down to the ranch. Oh, I think I'm gonna come over to this one. I don't, man, I, yeah. I'm gonna play this. Objective here, which I'll get three. Oh, right now I can draw three cards, exchange, and discard three cards, which I desperately need. I have a horrendously bad hand. Yeah, you got those trade tokens. Yeah, so I'm gonna get rid of these three. I do have three, three trade tokens, but or two trade tokens rather. But okay, I'm gonna do this instead. Um, and I guess now I could get rid of this for two bucks. I don't think I'm going to though. I'm gonna buy um, this uh, carpintero right here, or do I wanna, you know what, let's spend seven bucks. I'm only gonna buy one person. Uh, and let's hire this one, because it's only, they're both six, and I'll spend one more to get one more virtual uh, scythe and strength there. Nice. Okay, you're up. Um, let's see, so now you got the, now you made it kind of tough, because I only have the three movement still, so now it's getting a little bit Yeah, it's getting tough steep. in here. So I'm just gonna go to this first spot. I'm gonna move, uh, I only have now one Machinista, so I'll move my train one space forward and do two auxiliary actions, um, or two halves of the same one, and I'm gonna draw some cards, discard some cards. You can take it away while I figure okay. out what I'm doing. Um, ah. Ah. I think I'm just gonna go up here, and I'm gonna get two grain from my two grand heros. Um, and I don't have an exhaustion card to get rid of, so I'll do an auxiliary action. I think I'm just gonna draw a card and discard a card. Cause yeah, I am just, I'm a bit, oof, kind bit of a oof bit is stuck. It. Yeah, it's just like, it's not drawing very well here. All right. It happens, man. Can you move me over here? I'm gonna pay you a peso for the pleasure of stopping on your land. Uh, I'm gonna use a fronterizo for two pesos, and then I'm going to, I now have two gauchos, I'm gonna get some cattle. So two gauchos. Could have done something different. Um, I'm just gonna spend two dollars, two pesos, to take one of the threes, and I will take. Um, I'm gonna take the chaqueño, please. Okay. Because they're stronger. They are strong. Not worth as many points, but they are stronger. A little stronger. Um, okay, and this is what we refill. Okay, cool. Mm-hmm. Um, okay, me. 
It is on. All right, so I should have moved my train one more so I can get this shortcut, but I'm going to have to go to this ground head over here and pay him a dollar and then go up to Buenos Aires. Okay, so, so the peso goes up above them here. That's right. There you go. Okay. Okay, so now I am in Buenos Aires. I don't have a disc I can put down here. That's fine. I do have seven here. I don't have any ribbons to make it eight, unfortunately, but I do have seven. So I will get uh, seven nice. pesos. Um, and then... Where do I want to put it? I think I might want to put this on the five. I could go to the six, but after this, this is going to ship out, and I kind it's of want this right to go now, now so. and I'm not going to get on both of these. So I think I'm going to suspend the grain, and I'm going to put one on this one so I can get this one shipped out. Man, I wish, wish I could have gotten a higher hand. So this one, I can get rid of a grain to get a ribbon and a dollar. This one, I can get a dollar. Let's go. I, I think I'm going to be... Doing good on grain. Okay. I'm kind of going that way. So, so I'll I, go there. And you paid your grain for that ship? Yes. One grain? I did, yes. Okay. Nice. Okay. Uh, and then we'll put out people here. This one. What's the green? Um, and then what's the orange looking like? Orange right here. Yeah, we'll do the orange one right here. Sure. Uh, let's do, put out a carpintero. Let's put out this one. Okay. Boom. And then let's put out another gaucho. We're going to put another gaucho out there. Okay. So we've crossed now this first anchor spot, which means these three yellow anchor ships are headed to Europe. Bye. People are doing this on the uh, dock for five hours. Later. They're still, I can still see them. Uh, <laughs> ship's very big. That's a John Mulaney joke. I can't claim ownership of that. That's from John Mulaney. Um, anyway, so they're going to ship off. So these are going to go into these different city boards. So this one, for example, is going to go to Quay 1 of Rotterdam. Boom, and this ship is now Bye. in Europe. This one that Nick has is going to go to Quay 2 of La Havre, which is nice because it comes with a grain discount sure when you move things out. And this one goes in hit. Technically, it goes up to what? To La Havre as it well. It would go to La Havre Quay yes, 1. Indeed. So those ships are gone. They're going to be replaced with two random ships, which if you deliver to, they score you points. There's three ships. We put out three ships? You put out two more to replace okay. them. All right, so we've got a seven and an eight. There yeah, are so ones these that are ships higher, ones never, that are lower. Boop. They'll never ship out. They're just in a harbor all day. All day. You know, like those old timey ships that sit there yeah. and people can like just take worth points. Instagram photos on and stuff. Yeah, exactly. Um, so that's that. So now you have some. We have some stuff to to deliver Indeed. again over in Europa. All right, you have some more things out here, and then we are good to go. All righty. Okay. All right, let's go, man. I'm gonna move up here. I'm gonna turn in a Patagonico for two pesos right there. One and a two. Uh, now I can do another building. I still only have one Carpintero, but I'll do um, this building. I guess I'm gonna plop it right here. Nice, get some grain. All right, get some grain. Makes you pay a peso on the way yeah. if you pass by. We'll take that. It's bummer. Cost two pesos. I, sh I should pay for it, I suppose. A little bit. Okay. Um, for me, so I'm trying. I, I do want to get to that next. That next um, uh, train shortcut. That's what sure. right here. So I'm just yeah. gonna move up one because I still only have one maquinista. So can you move me up my train? Boop. And then I do have two auxiliary actions. I think I'm just gonna get two pesos though. I dig it. Or do I want to do that? You, you know what? Let's spend a grain. Okay. Let me use this one right here. Spend a grain. I'll get a ribbon and one peso. Nice. You have good grain production going I'm on. I'm doing okay here. I'm trying. That's what I'm doing. Let's go some. Let's go some Grand Hedos. Yeah. I'm gonna go one, two, three, and I have two private buildings in the farmlands here, so I will get two grain, and that's it. Okay. I'm gonna go here now. I'm just gonna do the one where I get two pesos. Mm -hmm. Boom, boom, and then I can move forward one. Boom to this one. I have two buildings in. You know what? No, actually, I'm not gonna do the pay two pesos. I'm just gonna do this one again because I'm about to get grain back. I'm gonna spend another grain to get another ribbon and then one peso. And then I move here and I'll get two grain because I have two buildings on farms. So boom, I just got back that grain. It's basically free to do those two ribbons, which is great. I like it. All right, all right. I'm just gonna move one spot forward. I'm gonna uh, turn in a Orlando Argentino for two pesos. And um, I'm gonna hire some people. I think I'm just gonna hire one. I'm gonna pay five pesos to hire another Macanista because I was liking nice. my train moving. This allows me to trash a card again. Yeah. I'm gonna trash another. Nada. Get out of here. Not that. Not no. that. Um, okay, I'm gonna go here. I don't have a front, front, a frontierzo, or yeah, that's what it's called. Um, Fronterizo. Fronterizo, that's what I was like. Frontierzo's wrong. Fronterizo. I don't have one of those to get rid of, so I won't get the two bucks, but I will buy a new cow. 
I already have a Blanco uh, Orinejero, Orijiner, Negro. There we go. That so, one's tricky. Yeah, yeah it's, it's Orijinegro is, is hard to say. Yeah. But um, so I do again. You know what? I think I'm just gonna go for. Oof, this is tough because these ones only take one gaucho. Yeah. Or I could use. Yeah, I'm just gonna use one of my guess. I'm just gonna get this one because I kind of want the strength. Um, so it's gonna be four bucks. Boom, and I'll get this cutie. Nice. All right. All right. I'm gonna move one, two over here. Um, I'm gonna do two auxiliary actions. I'm gonna draw and discard some cards so I get my hand right. Well, that made that easy. Those are right. gone. Uh, and then I can move forward one space. I will go here. I will gain two grain because I have two uh, Grand Heroes in my line there. If I can do one single auxiliary action, since I don't have a card I want to trash, I will draw a card and discard a card. Okay. Uh, I'm going to come uh, whoop up here. I will get rid of a Patagonico for two pesos. Nice. And then I am going to build a building. Mm. I think I'm going to build this one. This is kind of like the, essentially, kind of an upgraded version of this one to a degree. Yeah. Um, I want to make sure I put it into a farm. So let's put it right here. Why you got to, why? Is that where you're gonna put something? No, no. What's, how's that? In, is that in your way? I was gonna pay money to go past it. I don't want. Well, I guess go this I, way. You can go this no, way. I, yeah, you're right. <laughs> All right, man. I'll let you live. Never mind. <laughs> I'll let you. Live. I wanted to go on the farm. Um, so boom, and uh, yep, cool. Beautiful. I'm headed to Buenos Aires. Gonna hop on my train. To Buenos Aires to go. Okay. So now I got a disc in Rotterdam. I could let it rip. I'm gonna need, let's see. So, okay, that's fine. Um, I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna spend one grain, just one grain. I'm gonna move a disc down to this spot, which gives me six pesos. It'll be worth a point at the end of the game. Gets a little extra cash. I feel like we're early enough that I could still go for cash. Maybe that's unwise. I think so, yeah. Um, okay, and then I have a hand of two, four, six, Nine, ten, wow. eleven Ooh. with my perpetual. So I will get eleven. You're shipping pesos. better than me, I'll tell you. I'm really trying to, really trying to put together some good hands. So far, so good. So that's eleven. Uh, I'm gonna go up to this ship. This thing cost me four grain. I have three, and I'll pay two pesos for the final grain. Um, and I might just increase my hand limit again. Yeah, it's hard to beat. Yeah, yeah, I'm doing that. I'm doing that. The other thing I'm tempted by is this down here. I'd get two perpetual strength and you get three pesos right away. Yeah. But I'm gonna go with the bigger hand size. Yeah, you're not wrong. Let's go bigger hand size. Boom, this goes right down there. Since so we're near shipping the teal. Yeah, I mean, it'll be two more trips to Argentina and that'll be That's it. That's about for it, it, right? So, yeah. Um, all right, I'm gonna bring out this Grand Hero right there. I will bring out another Macanista. Refill the I'm refill up to nine cattle, and we'll put this ground hero right there. That's it for my trip to Buenos Aires. We had a lovely time. We had a lovely time while there. It's beautiful weather. Beautiful. Um, I'm back to the start of the trail. Back to my ranch and ways. My ranch and ways. I'm mm, I'm gonna go. Oh, I only have three. Oh, so I'm gonna have to stop. Drop. Oh. 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 Hmm. Oh, man. I'm trying to decide what Indecision, I want to do. Eh? Yeah, I'm trying to decide. I'm just going to go here. I'm going to get another ribbon. I'm trying to decide if I want to get a Granjero, because I was going to do it up here. But I'm like, I could do it here and there, potentially. True. True. How much perpetual strength you got? You I got two only have on the two. Board? I only have two, which is not like great, honestly. Sure. Uh, I think I'm not. I think I'm just gonna wait. I'm gonna wait. Okay. Alrighty. Sorry, I'm just getting my hand together. Uh, I'm gonna go to that first spot right there. I now have two Machinistas again, so I will go one and two. I'll pull in here, spend two pesos. I don't think I'm gonna take this. I could use a gaucho. Oh, yeah, now it's indecision. All over again. All over again. I'll do this. I'm going to take over. Boom. <laughs> so I spent my pesos. I'll put a disc out. I will collect this, which gives me two pesos, right? Yeah. 
Um, so I've effectively made this free to go down to. And disc wise, I will do this so I have yeah. a strength showing. Smart. Yeah. Alrighty. We like it. Oof. And yeah, I can do yeah. some uh, auxiliary actions. I will take care of while we, whilst Little you go. One, two. I'll take send you a peso. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Uh, I think I will get rid of this Orlando Argentino for two. Yep. And then I can hire somebody. Man, I think I'm going to get a spend mm -hmm. six, and I'm going to get this uh, Carpentiero. Carpentiero. No. Carpentiero. Thank you. Think, right? Uh yeah, I think so. Trying to get them right, y'all. Trying to do yeah, our you know. do our darn, um, do our this darn one's going to give me a strength. I can immediately build a building because I put it on here. Uh, and so now I have three uh, carpenteros or carpenteros. And, ooh, do I want to do that one? No. If you're that excited, that's not good for kind me. So I say of. you will respectfully pass. I kind of want to. Respectfully pass. Um, you kind of want to respectfully pass. You kind of want to respectfully pass. Yeah, let's go here. Great. Right there. So this one I can get two grain, and then I can immediately put a, a disc out into, uh, where is it? Hmm? Uh, into Rotterdam. Yeah, that's so useful. Yeah, well, you're building a sweet. whole line of buildings there at the bottom. I am. It's mostly because there's a lot of farms down here. It's yeah. honestly not for much other reason other than that. This is going good for you. Um, yeah. Is that it for you? Uh, yes, I could. No, yeah, that's I, I can't buy another person. Yep. Man, nice way to chain that together. I'm going to go one, two, three. Slow you down a little bit. Peso, yeah, it works. Yep. Um, I don't have a fronterizo to turn in, but I will buy some cattle. Um, let's... Do don't want to save some money. I got two gauchos, so I think I'll just spend two and take uh, the blue, please. Alrighty, okay. Thank you, sir. Appreciate it. I'm gonna go here. I'm gonna get an exchange token. I should probably start using these exchange tokens. Yeah. Um, and then now I can get a ganjero, but I have three virtual strength. Mm. Now I have one, two, three plus three is six. So my hope is that I don't have to turn in any kind of um, uh, personal. Oh, do I have enough to do this? I do. I have barely enough. Okay. Yeah, so I have six. I guess it doesn't really matter then. So I'm going to grab this one because it's giving me an extra two pesos. Nice. And I am going to hire this Granjero, and I'm going to put them here. It's going to cost me six bucks. It's going to give me a grain. Mm-hmm. Um, okay, cool. Great. All righty, I'm going to go... I didn't turn one, any cows, so I don't have to turn any exhaustion, which is two, great. Two, three. I'm going to turn in two of the same cow to get two pesos. And then I can move my train one spot forward. Okay. I'm going to go one, two, and I'm going to get three grain, because I now have three granjeros. Nice. Uh, and then I'll do an auxiliary action. I'm just going to do this one where I can spend a grain, uh, and I'll get another ribbon, okay. and then a peso. Beautiful. Um, mm -hmm. Oof. torn, man. Yeah. Uh, all right. I'm just trying to think if I did stuff a certain way. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> uh, okay. I'm going to go here. I'm going to gain a certificate. And I'm going to help out uh, the Grand Harrows, man. So I'm going to okay. spend two. Oh, man. Do I, do I dare get two exhaustion cards, man? Oof. Oof. I don't think I dare. I'm going to spend two cards, which will get me one exhaustion. So this gives me five strength, two, seven, plus one is eight total nice. strength. Um, and I'm going to help out some Grand Harrows. And how about up to uh, as many as you want, right? Or is it three? Up to three. Up to three. And let's just be wild. I'm just going to get wild, man. Can I get wild? Yeah, do you might get wild, dude. Uh, it's okay. So I'm going to help this one for four. Mm -hmm. Doesn't give me money. This one for four. Doesn't give me money. Hilarious. That's okay. I'm going to spend six and then eight, 14 Dirt. total to flip both of them down. That's one gives good. me a grain. Yeah. 
This one allows me to immediately put a disc out into uh, quite Rotterdam. one of Rotterdam, or I guess the only one. Um, and I will, with that, remove this, because I like that action that you're doing there. Mm -hmm. Okay. I'm just, that's a lot of money. I'm just Question for this, like, stuff. virtual three, is that only for the first Grand Hero, or is it for each one you get? That's just three, that's total. Total, okay. Total to your I figured, but I just want to double check. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to go straight up to Argentina. Whoop, I'm sorry, our brand is Iris from here. I do have a disc, a couple discs I could put down, actually. Sure. I know I, I want to make sure I have four, so I could spend two. Ooh, do I get money? Hmm. Or do I go for points? Let's go for some points. I'm gonna go two down, and we're gonna bring this disc down to here, which is gonna give me six points at the end of the game. Nice. Yeah. Um, okay. And then I only have seven. I still have a pretty bad hand of cards, but I do have four ribbons. I'm gonna use all four to get up to 11, wow. because this is about to ship soon, and I want, it's gonna ship right now, no, you don't have to. Just don't don't do it. I have to. I, the, the rules. No, so this is you don't do it. Oh, it doesn't have to have to ship right so now. You're not. But then you're gonna get another one on there. No, I'm gonna do it yeah, because no, it's not. only gonna no, help you. It's no, 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 literally no, only gonna no, help you. No, 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 no. So I'm gonna get. I'm not gonna go down on one of these lowly ships. <laughs> I gladly I'm a purple will. Purple ship dude. Purple ship kind of guy. Now let's go ahead and do it. Worth a try. It was worth a try. Um, so I'm gonna put a disc. I'll put a black disc. I really want to do the one where we get two extra strength, but I think I need to increase my hand limit. I'm just I'm just floundering over here. We're, we're like. living the life out here with six cards, man. I tell you. Yeah, it's tough, 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 tough. Okay, um, and then we will move. So let's put out this. Uh, ooh, or do I? What I actually need? Let's put this going ahead over here. Okay. Boom. We'll put out this gaucho. Boom, and then we'll put out this. Uh, actually, let's put out this. I know, let's put up two gouges, yeah. Boop, boop. Okay, well now we're going to ship these right. green ships out. These ones are going to go away. They're not doing nothing. Boo. All right, these are both going to go to Quay, one of Liverpool. I had to stop Mikey a little bit. I was like, oh, yeah, no. Nah. Nah. I wasn't going to go for those lowly ships, man. <laughs> I'm a big ship guy. I'm a big ship kind of guy. Classic big ship dude. All right, we got a four and a 16. Oof. Okay. Ship. All righty. All right, we're out here. Those are in Europe now. All righty. Back to me. Nick, quickest action of all time, getting two grain. Boom. I will refill. Uh, Restock. Whilst you go. Okay, I'm going to go here. Um, I guess I will draw two cards and then discard two cards. Oh, my stars. <laughs> that good, I was huh? drawing real bad, man. Real that bad good, all day. Huh? Okay, now I'll move forward one, and I will get one, two, three. Three, four grain. Oh, I'm sorry, I spent this four grain. I'll go back up to four because I have four buildings in no kidding. farms. Yeah. Wow. Okay, you're up. Um, right on, right on, right on. I'm going oh, wow. to go one spot forward and I'm going to spend six pesos and hire a gaucho. Okay. That's all the money I got. Can't get the one with the strength. This allows me to trash a card and get two pesos. So I guess I got kind of a two dollar discount effectively. Okay. Um, and I'll trash a card while you go. Okay. I'm gonna go here. I'm gonna turn in this uh, uh, fronterizo for two pesos, uh, and then I can buy another cow. I really need to get like just other cows. So I'm gonna spend eleven. I'm gonna get one of these Aberdeen Angus. Hey man. Tell you what. Uh, all right, I'm gonna go one, two. I'm gonna do two auxiliary actions and then move forward. I'm going to draw two cards and discard two cards because my hands is weird, man. Yeah, hands is weird. Hands is weird. All right, I'm gonna do that. And then I'm gonna move forward a spot. I will get uh, grain for my Grand Heroes. I've got nice. four, so I'm up on seven now. Sweet. And I can do a single auxiliary action or trash and exhaustion card. Sounds about yeah, right. Yeah, sounds about right. And that's it for okay. me. I'm gonna go here, I'm gonna get two grain, and then again, I can put a white disc out onto uh, Rotterdam. I think I'm gonna do the one here that gives me a perpetual strength. Nice. Yeah. Nice, nice, nice. Do I, want, yeah. do I wanna do that, actually? Yes, you do. Yeah, I do. I don't know. What do you do? Does but, it help me? Nope. I knew it. I knew it. <laughs> All right, me? Yep. I got decisions to make. But first, decision. 
Buenos Aires. Okay, so I am gonna spend two grain, because I do have a disc in Rotterdam, two grain, and I'm gonna move up here to the north because I need something in the north for uh, my objective there. This can give me four points into the, the game, nothing now. Um, and I've got, this is three, four, 10, 11. I could go up to 13, but it's not gonna get me to a different ship, so I'm gonna save my certificates, take the 11 pesos. And um, I'm trying to think of what to focus on. I think this is what I'm gonna do. I'm actually gonna go down onto this ship here. I could go here, which is gonna ship out in a bit, but I think I'm gonna go here because I can get a black border disc off my board. Mm. So, yeah, which is nice. I'm going to do this one first because I'd rather have more movement than the two points. I think I can get that later. So I'm like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do that. So I'm gonna go down here to this ship. This is not gonna ship out, but we're three points into the game. I have to pay one, two, three grain. I'll use grain all the way. Um, now I have more movement because Nick's making it a little busy down there. So now I have five yeah, it's movement. a little busy, a little biz pants right. here. So that's all good and done. I will go here. Sore. I will add. Okay, this carpintero right there. And um, let's see, I guess I'll do you. Boom, so we're gonna get a couple more cattle out. I don't know how many we have out there. Two, four, six, seven. Looks like we need two more cattle. Okay. Oof, not very, it's going, it's yeah. going. I feel like I put kind of a scatterbrained game together here. I don't feel like I have much of a focus. Oh, yeah. Let's see, I'm gonna go here. I don't think I'm going to get rid of my Patagonico, but I will put out another building here. Let's go ahead and do, yeah, let's go ahead and do, oh, I can't do that actually, never mind. Let's do this one. What was I thinking? What was I thinking? You were thinking about, yeah, I'll go ahead and do this one. Cheese fritters. Cheese fritters. Yep, yep, that's what you're thinking about. Put that one right there. It's gonna cost me four bucks. Um, okay, you're up. All righty, man. Um, what do I reckon? What do I reckon? What do I reckon? Uh, all right, I'm gonna go, sorry. One, two, three, four, I have to pay a peso. And uh, I'm gonna hire, uh, I'll turn in a fronterizo for two pesos. And then, I'm gonna get some cattle. I've now got three gauchos, and so I think I'm gonna get one of uh, the franquier, franqueros, pardon me, mm -hmm. for six, is it? Yeah. Whatever the highest value is, please. Yes, Thank you very much, sir. All right. Okay, I'm gonna go three, hmm. Trying to decide. Let's go one. Yeah, let's just go on. I'll turn in uh, two uh, Niatas for uh, two bucks, and then uh, if I can move my train forward once. Doot. Okay, that's it. All right, man. Um, I think I'm gonna go one. I think I'm gonna go. I think I'll go up to your spot. I'm gonna go one, two, three. Okay. I'll turn in two Holanda Argentinos for two pesos and move my train one spot forward. Okay. Um, I am gonna go uh, one, two, three. Can have a peso. Thank you, sir. And then I can uh, draw cards and discard cards up to the amount of gouches I have. I have two and then I will get two ribbons as well. So I'll go ahead and do that mm. while you're doing that. Alrighty. Um, okay. I think I'm just gonna go one, two, and get two grain because we've got two buildings in the farmlands. So I draw two. Mm. So we're getting close to shipping out those last ships. Hey, yeah. I'm gonna get to the big one. I would really love it. Yeah, I know. I'm just like we are getting. Most likely when I'm there, I'll, I'll probably end up pushing it off. It'll be, 
No, you're not going to do that. I might have to be do a that. Good guy. I might have to do, do that. that. Well, I'm going to beat you to Argentina and make sure it doesn't <laughs> Okay, that's possible. I'll go here. I'll get an exchange token. I need these. I really should use these exchange tokens. Okay, so now I can uh, get uh, Help on Granjeros, and I have three extra. So I have one, two, three, four, just straight up. It's five, six, seven, just straight up. So... And I really need a yellow and I need a green. So seven, I might get rid of two of these to make it 11. It's gonna give me another exhaustion card, but that way I can get uh, this one, which will give me two pesos, and I can get this one, and that way I That's am covered. good on nice. my things. And that'll give me two pesos. I'm just gonna use an exchange token while I go if you don't mind. Okay, go ahead. And uh, that is it. Oh, that's not good. I'm gonna use another exchange token if you don't mind. Be there, if I can get this a certain way, then life would be good, but I didn't, so life is therefore bad. Life is terrible instead. Oh no. Okay. I really, oh, wait, I'm just card, no I'm not. Three, six, mm -hmm. One short. Don't ship those ships, man. I might, Mikey, I might. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> oh, don't do it. Don't do it, sir. I need that there, man. Um, all right. I'm gonna go one, two, three, four. Mm. And I'm gonna do a action. Get rid of those. Okay, I can move forward one spot, which puts me on to, I don't think I can at this point go, yeah, so I'll go here, I'll get four grain. Nice. And um, the single action, I will spend a grain to get a peso and a certificate. All right. Alrighty, so I really feel like, I mean, I wasn't planning on going to Buenos Aires on my turn, but I didn't think you were gonna go quite so far so now I feel like I should go Buenos Aires, make sure you can't get another th ship out, which I feel like is gonna be very bad for me. I already feel like you're doing better than me and I feel like that'd be very bad for me. So I think I'm gonna use an exchange token because I now at this point need to get a better hand going here. The pressure is off. <laughs> oh my gosh, yes. Um, all right, then those two will go away. What am I at now? So that's... Oof, yeah, it's not exactly what I want it to be, but okay. I'm gonna go up to Buenos Aires. Had just to. Don't ship the ships. I have to ship the ships, Mikey. I must try and slow you down just a little bit. Just yeah. a little bit. What to see? I have more buildings and stuff than you, but I feel like you've just been doing much better on this front than me, but we'll see. Okay, so I um, can move something down. I have a discount here. Yep, two grain discount there. Yeah, so I think I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna spend three grain. One, two, three, and I'm gonna bring it down here to the seven point spot. Could go down here and get 12 bucks, but I'm like, ah, I feel like I know, points, less points, more money. Points uh, is gonna be more useful right now. Sure, sure. And then can you do that? Do one we'll delivery, okay. one extra delivery per trip. So then I have um, two, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and I can go up to 10, 11. I think I'm not gonna use my um, things because nine is kind of the highest I can get to right now. Sure, sure. So I'm gonna do that one. I will just get my hand size bigger. We'll go here. It's gonna cost me four grain. I only have three, but I'll spend two bucks. But then I'll also get back nine. There you go. Okay. And then, yeah, let's bring out this granjero. Let's bring out this uh, carpintero. And then let's bring out this one too. Gotta. Yeah, gotta have to do it before Mikey it. can get another one on I there. I dislike it, but I do respect gotta it. Gotta try it. All right, so neither of these uh, nope. have anything on it, but these Bye. discs go to Liverpool 1. Bye. We draw out our final two ships. We got a 13 and a 14. So now again, we can ship to these ones. These won't ever leave yeah. the harbor. And you um, can ship to the one and the 18 multiple times. Everything else, yep. one uh, of your disc per ship. Everyone can go to the same ship, of course. Indeed. All right, man. All right. Back to, back to the beginning of the track with you, you mischievous man. Mischievous man. 
All right, man. Straight now to Buenos Aires with there. me. Yep. Now I do. I have to spend some stuff, but I'm gonna go big since you didn't let me ship. I'm gonna go. Uh, first, I'll do a delivery. Actually, sorry. Pardon me. I'm going to spend. Um, I'm gonna spend six grain of my seven, and I'm gonna move from here up to here. Nice. We're 14 points, but it's a lot of grain. And then, um, cattle wise, I've got three, six, nine, 11, 13, 15, 16 here, 17, 18. Let's go wow. right to the big ship. <sighs> Man, right for the big ship. I had to do everything to get that hand going, Man. but uh, I'll get 18 pesos. Um. I set myself up here for the future. Hopefully, I'm going to spend yeah. some, a lot of money on grain right now. Yeah. Um, and then I can take a black disc. Um, I'm going to take this one that gives me more strength and gives me three pesos up to here. Ooh. And I have six grain to pay. I can only pay one physically. So then five means $10 spent hey. on grain. You got it. Yep. Had to do it. Had to do it. Um, All right. Okay. Let's see, let's go blue here. And then I'm gonna put a Machinista into play, please, down okay. there. And then we'll put this Grand Hero there. Okay. All right. Um, I think I'm gonna go here. I think we'll just uh, draw two cards and then discard two cards. And then I'll get to go here, I'll get grain. I now have five buildings in Farms, and so I'll just immediately get five grain. Okay. All right, I have to discard two cards. Which ones do do? Let me get my stuff together here. Can you put it back at the start of the trail? Yeah. Thank you, sir. Um, trying to think of where I want to go. I might. In fact, I think I will. Can I just go to that first spot, please? I'm going to move my train one space forward. And then do some auxiliary actions, which I'll do while you go. Okay. Um, what do I want to do here? Let's go one step forward. I think I will turn in this Fronterizo for two. And then, kind of in a weird spot, I guess I could do that. It would be very expensive. Do I even have enough money to do that? Not quite. Um, I think I'm just gonna spend 11 and buy one of those franqueros. Nice. Um, okay. Uh, if you can move me on to your spot, sir, I'll pay you a peso for it. Thank you. Thank you, sir. I don't have a card to turn in, but I will, um, I've got three gauchos. I'll spend two of them to buy an Aberdeen Angus for 11. And then I'll use my final gaucho to buy uh, one of the orange, please, for four. Okay. Can't remember the name offhand. Karaku, uh, right? Karaku, yep. There you go. Um, all right, that's it. Um, I'll go, do I want it? here's the thing, is like, I have all these up here. I guess it's points, right? So, yeah. Because like, I just I can't bring all of them down. I'm not gonna have time. I mean, yeah, everyone that goes on Rotterdam is two points, so. Yeah. But, zero over there, right? Yeah, exactly, and, and it's two points, exactly. So I was like, yeah, it's worth it there. Sure. And I'll get two more green. Oop. Okay, um, I'm gonna go, go there, go there. Thoughts, thoughts, thoughts. One, two, three. Wait. Um, sorry. Very good. Uh, I'm gonna go one, two, three, four, five, and get two grain. Nice. Yeah, I'm just gonna work my way around. I got kind of specific stuff I wanna try to do, but we'll see. Shoot, I don't have enough money for that. Um, yeah. Or do I? I technically do. Yeah, I'm gonna go here. I'm gonna turn in this uh, Patagonico for two bucks. Um, and then I'm gonna build a building. I am gonna overbuild. I am gonna overbuild this two with this five here. Nice. Boom. Because I have three uh, carpenteros. Uh -huh. And so, boop. Boom, that's out the game. You're off to the side. And then um, that's gonna cost me six bucks. All right. 
Yeah, that building is sweet. I'm gonna go yeah. one, two here. I will turn in an Orlando Argentino for two pesos and hire somebody. Um, I can never afford to do two people, which is probably really just being it inefficient. Is it's hard. To do two uh -huh. is hard. I'm not going to lie. I'm going to spend one, two, three, four, five, six, and then seven to get this. There's one extra, of course, because the size. Nice. Yeah, there's a little sickle there. It's showing. Sickle. Um, to hire Machinista, which allows me to trash a card. Um, and this time, I'm just going to trash this exhaustion card. Okay. Might as well. All righty. I'm going to go one, two. Oh, I have to stop, don't I? Um, do I have two of the same? I do. I guess I'll stop here. I'll move my train. Uh, let's, yeah. Let's move our train down, Mikey, to where your Machinista is down there. And I'll spend um, a dollar, and I'll just put one of my discs there. Okay. Um, let's go ahead and do this one. Boop. Okay. All right. I'm going to move up here. Um, I'm going to take that... 18. Yeah, you're, you, already you already got, got it. it right? You already got it. We'll see if it gets around and down and Yeah, if you can get it down, but it's free points. We can. Um, and my single um, auxiliary action, I'm going to spend one grain to do uh, a certificate and a peso. Nice. Um, and then I'll spend, I can move my train one. I'll pop down in here and spend four pesos and put this out for four points right there. It gives me a little more movement. And that's nice. it. All right, I'm gonna go one, two, three. I'll have to give you a peso. Uh, I will get a grain, and then I can put just a, a disc from a black area out immediately onto Liverpool. I'm actually gonna become the station master at this if it's okay. Right. I'm just gonna spend a gaucho to do it. Get two grain, go ahead, sorry. All right, and then put that onto Liverpool. Liverpool. Uh, and I'll get three pesos for this. Uh, Quay one, right, yeah. Okay. Okay, just double checking. To Buenos Aires we go with a shortcut. Oof, such shortcuts. Um, such short, many cuts. Um, do I dare? Sure. I'm going to spend um, two grain, one, two, to go down here. Be worth five points, same as if it stayed up here, but I'll get seven pesos. I might as well make use of some of that money, especially because I'm about to have a lot of grain costs again. Yeah. Because. I put together a three, six, nine, and six is 15, 16, nice. 17, 18. Sweet. Going big again. Yeah. Um, so I'll do that. All right, made some change. Um, so I'm going to go back up to the 18 shift. You can deliver here multiple times. Um, I'm just going to do this. Blam. It costs six grain. Again, I have one. We'll pay ten dollars. Yeah. So definitely kind of eating into my points a little bit with yeah, that. Yeah, but, but not too much. It's though. well I mean, worth you're, it. You're, to, yeah, I think it's. it's I think, well you're, you think you're coming out ahead on it regardless. All right, let's put this out here. Okay. Um, we'll put another. I think when I go there, it's gonna be the last time. So. Gaucho. Boop. Ooh, that's interesting. Yeah, I think, I think, well, I mean, yeah, I mean, well, I guess I will be able to could, make it happen if you want. Which I think I probably will, because I think I should not let you get back around if I can help uh, it. Well. well, I can still get around, but it, you'd get the, you'd push that off the board. Was well, it everyone else gets one more turn? One or? more turn. Okay. So, depending on how fast I move here, I might try to race around. We'll see. We'll see. Yeah. Um, okay, I'm going to go... I guess now I made it so that if you go there, the game will have to end, so I better yes. get moving. <laughs> yeah, you better move it. Yeah, I think... We'll see, we'll see. I'm down there if you could. Um, so. Okay, so now I can use my... Uh, to get some Grand Heroes. I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine of, like, the base. Oh, but I would need that to come back around. Ugh. Yeah, I wanted to get an objective, but I realized I, I would need it to come back around, which I think it would not... So I have nine as a base. I think I'm just going to get this one and this one because their colors don't matter. And that way I just don't have to get any exhaustion. And those will just hang off to the side. Cool. Hmm. Okay. Um, oh, I don't know how many turns I have before you get there. So let me just go... Oh... 
Let me math this out. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go here. Boom. My drunken cowboy. And I'm just gonna um, spend, I now have just the two gauchos and I'll spend 11 to get another Aberdeen Angus, please. Thank you, sir. Hmm. So, yeah, I think I really want to try and get up to 18 on that one. Um, yeah, let's go one, two. Oh, except for, no, I'm not going to, I'm going to go one here first. I'm going to use auxiliary action. I'm going to go down a grain to gain a ribbon and a peso. Nice. Uh, and then I'll move my train forward one. I don't think I'm going to grab an objective because I just don't think there's any way it can come back through in time. So Sure, sure. I guess I'll grab this one just in case it does. All right. Because I can fulfill this one. So if we get there, we will. I don't think I will, though. All right. All right. Um, I'm going to go one, two, three, four, five up to here and just get two green. Okay. Oh, this doesn't go my hand. Um, so now, what do I have right now? So, yeah, I don't, oof, I don't know if I will be able to. I mean, although I have four exchange tokens, so I could potentially draw eight cards and discard eight cards. Nice. And like, just try and get there. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and uh, one, let's go up to Buenos Aires. So I can bring one down. I have seven grain. I should probably just bring down the biggest point one I can, huh? I would, I mean, this is your last turn now. I have so seven grain, yeah, so I'm actually gonna go boom. I'm gonna bring this down to here. Give me 12 points. Yeah, that's great. Um, okay, and then, oh, I'm sorry, before I do this, I'm gonna use, I'm just gonna use all of these, all four, why not? Eight cards, and I can. Those are worth 18 points a piece. <laughs> They're not. Just wanna see what kind of Draw hand eight, I discard can get. eight, get your best hand together, so, man. Let me see if I get my best hand together here. <laughs> okay, definitely you, definitely not you. <laughs> definitely not you. Maybe you, maybe you, definitely not you. Ooh, I'm not gonna have a great hand. Um, let's see, so I need six total, so what's six? You need one, two, three, four, Five. Okay, one more. I guess it doesn't really matter, so I will choose you. Okay, so I, this is the best hand. I didn't get my Franchetto, although I don't think it's in my thing yet. Okay, so now to turn these in, I will have um, two, four, six, 11, 14, 15. I can't get in there. 18. Good, I got there. Nice. Barely, barely. I was like, just let me get up there. Um, I will have to pay six. Grain, I have no more grain, so I will have to, I will not get so as much get, money. I'll get, you'll get six, six bucks. Dollars. Yeah, I'll get six dollars back. 12 goes worth the grain cost, but hey, hey, 12 we points, got there. That'll work. Get your disc on there. Man. Um, yeah. I guess I'll just take this one because I'll do this one because you can get. Can points. I do this one first? Yeah. Mm -hmm. oh, okay, cool. Then, heck yeah, I will. Okay, there's that, and then, yep, we're gonna go boom. I guess here, Makinisa will push this off. I'll get two points too, which will be good. Nice. Uh, and then I'll just put this one uh, right there. Okie okay, dokie. Okay. Right there. Okay. All right. Um, Last turn, sir. Well, I better get to Buenos Aires then, man. I'm going to go one, two, three, and then pop up the That's what's so nice there. with the shortcuts. You were able to get there. If this was normal, yeah. you wouldn't be able to get there at all. You got to unlock the movement. I have six movement now. So, yeah, you can get boogie. In. Yeah. Uh, okay. So, I don't have any discs to do an extra delivery. So, I'm going to go right to uh, this. I've got... Uh, four and six is 10, 11. My bonus certificate is 12. Um, so I'll get 12 pesos. Nice. Um, unfortunately, I was wanting to find a way to get to 13, but I can't, yeah. so I'm gonna drop down to the seven. That's shift, fine, three but points. that's all right. So three points is three points. I'll do this, that's three points. Uh, I'll spend the grain from my little track here, save that money, and um, that's gonna be that, man. That's we don't it. have to worry about putting stuff on the no, board. The we game is sure over. Don't. So we go right into end game scoring, my friends. Okay. All righty. Just separating stuff out. All right. Oof. Just stand by and we'll tell you when we're ready for scoring. 
All right, man. All right. So the first thing we're going to take a look at is money. They have every five pesos is a point. Uh, I have 15, so I'll get three, dollars, three points. Two. All right, Nick gets two points. I get three. Points for the buildings on the board. I've got one here for one, and I've got one there for two total. And I'll get three, nine, um, 13, 14, 15. 15. I definitely did do that. All right, now we're gonna get points for um, discs on ships. I've got two on the 18, so it's gonna be 12, 24, Oof. and then six more is 30. Nice, I'll get 12. Okay. Now we're gonna get points for all the stuff in the cities. So let's start up up here. Um, you're gonna get five, 10, 15 for those yep. three that are there. You got two more here, 17, yep. and six is 23, 23 25, 35. 25, uh, 42, and that one's nothing, 42. 42 points from the cities. From the cities. All right, I've got five and 14 is 19 here, 20, 24. Okay, so I'll right. be on that one then. Yeah. Definitely beat me there. Yeah, I was just like chucking discs. I was like, good, just yeah, go there, just go there, just go over there. All right, from up here, I've got three. Uh, so let's see, eight and three is 11. I got five. Five points there. Any uh, Grand Heroes not flipped? You've got a few. Got oh, yeah, eight. I got four, so eight. So eight points, I have zero. Yeah, because I need them. needed them for my objectives. All right, so now we're going to take a look at the cattle that we hired. And uh, if you have any exhaustion cards, subtract from this. Yeah, number. so I have two exhaustion cards. So that's going to get rid of this Frank Franquiero, unfortunately. Um, it's going to undo them. But, I mean, I have 12. All right, I got I 27 in cattle. 12. Okay. Now objectives complete or incomplete. I have um, a disc in the north and two of uh, three cattle. And I have a disc in the west and a franquero. So both mm -hmm. those are complete for six total points. Nice. Uh, this one needed two buildings and a, a green granjero. Have that. One building, one disc in the west. I have one disc in the west. And then this, so it's going to be six points total as well. Okay. All right, station master tiles. I have these, so for every two discs on chips, I have four. I get three points a piece, nice. so that's six points. For every uh, two of these I have, I only have three, so I'll get six points here, three points here. I have no Grand Heroes, zero, so it's nine points for those. You have lots of Grand Heroes. Oh, no, not out no, here, yeah, yeah. I'm not flipped. Not flipped, yep. Um, okay, did you get any workers in the final two? No, nah, not quite. I meant to, I never got I there. I know, me too. It just, just stopped buying. <laughs> All right, we both uncovered this for two points, and you got two points for ending the game. Yeah! I'm curious. I think it's going to be a little closer than I was expecting, but I think you still won? Well, we're going to have to find out, man. I don't, I don't know. know. I, beat you, I beat you in some places I wasn't really expecting to, so we'll actually see. I think it's going to be a little closer than we, than I taught. All right, man, we have the final scores, close game. Yeah. We played very different games. We did. You had a score of 106, I had a score of 114. Ooh, that is close. close Eight points. Man. Wow. wow. Yeah, if I could go one more out here, one more down here, something like that, man, that would be cool. did such a good job of rushing the game forward before yeah. I could, like, capitalize. Well, that's why every single time I was like, no, I'm going to do it because I think if I give you more time, I'm going to yeah. be screwed. So yeah. I was like, I have to do this because you cannot have more time to do this. Right. Wow, close well game. Well done, close one. Just edged it out. Ooh. Just edged it out. Hey. You know, so the next one, who knows which way it would go. Yeah. So that was... Ooh, Great Western Trail Argentina. Great close Western game. Trail Pulled Argentina. Pulled it out just a little bit. I know. Yeah. That was close. A little close, close but, man. You know, we kind of went different strats and just edged it out a little bit. Yeah. Got that one extra delivery on the 18 ship. You know what I mean? Yeah, it's interesting. It's it, The whole delivery method is so interesting because, like, you're getting points, but the points are, you're not getting points from the ships for the most part. Yeah. You're getting them Those later on. Ones. So there's it's, it's kind of like delayed shipment thing in the game, which I think is very, very interesting. I kind of like that the value of the disc that you deliver is not necessarily set yet because when yeah. it goes off to one of the cities, it may then go into an area that's yeah. worth more, or you may say, you know what, I'm gonna forego this for some money now. There's a lot of fun decisions to make with those discs, uh, even after they're delivered. It's very yeah, cool. yeah, it's really really cool. Now let's let us know let us know what you thought of Great Western Trail Argentina down in the comments below. Uh, and that's gonna be it. Until next time, I'm Nick. I'm Mike. We're the Brothers Murphy. We'll see you later. Bye. Thank you so much for watching that episode of The Game House. Great Western Trail, Argentina. Is it better than the original? We honestly think so. What do you think? Let us know down in the comments below. We want to give a big shout out to our channel sponsors, Restoration Games, Lucky Duck Games, and Board Game Geek. And for the month of September, we are sponsored by the Thorstrid family, Chris Thorstrid, Baby Bjorn, and all the great Thorstrid clan. They're absolutely amazing. We absolutely love them. Big 
been followers of us for a long time. We've gotten to know them. They're just really wonderful people. Thank you so much for sponsoring Bros Murph for the month of September. Make sure to check out Great Western Trail 2nd Edition over there on the right side of your screen. And what else is over there? Check it out.